Hey guys, it's Charrua101 again. Uh, some people were asking me what figures I had for DC Universe and stuff. Well, I mean, I got my Green Lantern that I had, the Mego, and then I have a few over there. Those are like basically DC Direct that I have. I kind of like. So I kind of wanted to put them over there. I mean, you know, Shazam, Wonder Woman, Green Lantern, The Flash. I got that battle armor, Wonder Woman. I tried to get rid of her so, long, so much that I was like, ah, I'm just going to keep her, you know? And then I got the Green Lantern, um, I got Green Arrow, I thought I, I loved that Batman, I loved it, you know, it's definitely for my son, you know, uh, I'm a major Met fan, so that's a little jacket that's for my son, so, you know, I'm a huge Met fan, uh, but they were asking me my DC Universes, um, guys, I don't really have much, I basically just got into them, I got Cyclotron, I got an extra Negative Man, uh, John Stu, which I'm going to address a few things real quick, I won't take too long. Um, let's see, I got that, uh, that Green Lantern, not that one, it was real nice, you know, uh, what else do I got, I got yeah, a few Hydras that I had to put over there, Atrocitus, uh, Mr. Terrific, Joker, um, let me put the slide on, it's probably too bright, there you go, Riddler, that Black Adam, a lot of people were asking me if I was going to get rid of that, but I'll be honest with you guys, for me to get rid of this, it's got to be something real good. I mean, he's he's mint on card, you know what I mean? Um, I know he's super hard to get. Man, bad. a lot of these I tried to get rid of, but thank God I kind of kept them because I think I did a good decision keeping them. DC Universe, if uh, most of you who've dealt with me and know me, they know, man, I'm very OCD about that. Whatever I get in uh, loose, I like to have mint on card. Uh, just because just I like them. I got the Donna Troy, the Flash, um, let's see, Green Lantern and stuff. I picked up some today that I want to kind of address. Because there are some people that are waiting for some stuff from me. My deepest and serious apologies, man. Uh, Dalen, uh, Stashbin, Junior, uh, Box. But nobody gives a fuck about Box and Type X, you know. So who cares what he thinks. Um, I think, uh, yeah, and uh, Solid Snake in my pants, man. Guys, I've been so busy. Uh, this is the only time, sometimes at night. So when I get out of work, you know, Solid and a few of the, my, my closer friends know what I do. And um, my job is very demanding. I haven't had time. But listen, Stashbin and Dalen... Guys, um, I will take care of you, okay? I have your stuff, and it's ready to go. Uh, the last time I thought I had sent it, I sent like two things out, and I could have sworn your stuff was out. But you know what? One of them came back. I don't know what address I put, but I know one's going to Canada. Another one's staying in the States and stuff. Uh, solid. I have your stuff ready to go. And uh, again, my sincerest apologies, guys. That's not in my nature. I've just been so busy the last two weeks. Um, I've just had you know, a lot of cases to take care of, and, and, and I've just been needed at work. And it's about making the money, guys, and, you know, um, taking care of my family. Um, okay, so this is real quick. Some stuff that I picked up. Um, probably one of the reasons I probably didn't make it to uh, the post office because I figured I'm going to share this stuff real quick. But um, I picked up a little haul today. I'll start with the uh, DC Universe. I will address that now. Guys, I have a hookup with a real good, real nice gentleman. He's got a lot of the waves. I picked up Captain Cold today. I picked up, I don't know who the hell this is because, again, I don't know the some of the the figures but i picked up the shark guy with the piece i picked up a flash and you know what i just noticed guys these flashes are different one's going one way the other one's going the other way so that's whacked i don't know why they do that but whatever you know i still like it i got another Superboy, and i got a cat matui with the kilowog piece okay so those are the dc universe i picked up today and i got them at a great price contact me I'm not going to say it over YouTube because, uh, you know, that's my business. But uh, contact me if you're interested in any of these. I'll do what I can. You know what I mean? But like I said, Dalen, Stashbin, uh, Junior, uh, Box, Solid. You guys are going to get your stuff this week, I assure you, on my word. Man, I just I feel so bad because, uh, you know, I got the stuff from uh, Dalen and Stashbin sent me the stuff. And I know Solid's been waiting for uh, some things I've been needing to send them. So, um, you know what I mean? Um Again, but uh, this is also some stuff I picked up. Guys, this Star Wars stuff that I picked up today, it, it's incredible. Red Hulk, you wouldn't believe, man. Red Hulk 80, if I were to tell him what I got this stuff at, man, he'd flip out. Uh, I met some guy, a great, super nice person, man. He's got this great Star Wars stuff. This guy was so nice, man, that this, I know this is a hardship to get the Royal Starship, but all the figures that are in the, I guess, that are being solicited in the back of the box and stuff like that, he gave me every single figure. He even gave me extra Naboo soldiers. Um, I know it comes with that red droid that's in there. He gave me two extra hard as hell to get droids, man. 
But uh, I mean, just I know this ship goes for super major money. But uh, I mean, I just I got this ship. I mean, it's just incredible price. He also hooked me up with this Dagobah, um, Luke Skywalker X-wing that I thought was super nice, mint on card. I got these pilots. I love this pilot right here. This clone trooper commander pilot. That was super nice. I got some other ones. John Brannon, Shira Bree, Jack Farrell. These are real nice. Some other stuff. An extra little Batman for my son. I thought I liked this because I don't know if this came with uh, this chick, Mary J. Watson. But I thought that was cool. These are some of the figures I picked up. Again, you guys see the two packs. I finally picked some up thanks to Vega 185 via Juggy Smash. Who basically told them that we're out already. So um, that was nice. You know, I got that variant. I know a lot of people have been trying to get that variant. So only me, Juggy, and uh, Vega were able to pick one up. So I guess we're the only ones really in Orlando who were able to pick them up. So I guess some of the Orlando guys are looking at this. They're pretty pissed. But Vega 185 went on a rampage, and he picked one up for me, man. And uh, Juggy got his. So, you know, major shout-outs for those two guys. Real nice guys. And, uh, you know, he picked those up. And then I got this one. This is super nice. I haven't opened them yet, but I'm sure I will. But I think I'm going to get uh, one more of each. Before I open them. Um, again, these figures. This is more for like Red Hulk 80 and some of my other Star Wars subscribers. I know you guys like Star Wars. But man, guys, I will tell you. All these figures that I picked up, man, I got them for like 50 cents to a dollar. Which I thought was a great hit pickup. I, I picked up a few loose ones. I picked up some for my son to play with. You know, TIE Fighters. Some X-Wings and stuff. The guy even gave me some stands. I picked up this nice one because I know it's got Dooku's lightsaber. I thought that was cool. Crazy ass throne room uh, dual thing. Got this really nice Batman for my little boy. I know he's gonna like that. So that Batman is really nice. He can play with. Uh, also, uh, this guy's got Marvel Universe, man. Super nice guy. And uh, he hooked me up with some Marvel Universe. I got him at a great, great price, man. Like, just nasty. Nasty, stupid price, you know? He even hooked me up with a free clone trooper, which is nice. I like these, the Star Wars ones, uh, Clone Tro Clone Wars. But I got a, at least I got a, you know, again, I'm not an MU fan per se, but at the price I got him on, I couldn't go wrong. So I'm happy with these because I'm a big Iron Man fan. And Spider-Man, you know, that's all right. I'm down with Spider-Man. I got a bike for like 25 cents at the garage sale, you know. Of course, you guys know all this stuff. This crap I got, you know. But again, this was some of the hookup stuff. I even got a... Uh, some other little things I'll probably show another another video. I don't want to make them too long because nobody likes the long videos. But I want to share this little haul I got with you guys, you know, so you guys can see what I got. But again, I got the two packs. But listen, uh, a lot of shout outs, man. Thanks for being patient, Dalen and, and, and Stashbin. You two guys, man, and I appreciate it because I know you've never dealt with me. I don't want you guys to think that I'm out of character. But that, you know, my sincerest apologies, guys. You will get your stuff. I've just been real busy. But uh, I assure you this week I took a lot of time off. So this week you, get, uh, you guys will get everything. And, uh... Both Anthony's man, Tone, you're gonna get your uh, your negative man. You know, you better send me that that John Stewart, bitch. I ain't messing around with you. I know where you live. All right. So also, solid snake, Papa. Um, you're gonna get your stuff, bro. You get it this week, uh, mijo. So if anything, give me a give me a ring. Uh, real quick, this is one that uh, Vega 185 made. I'm gonna give him a lot of props. I don't know if you can see it real good, but with the lab, he made uh, the uh, Giant Man Buster and the Giant Man. And basically, what this is basically showing. Is that they were gonna fight in the beginning and then they went ahead and turned into their uh, more bigger alter egos so I thought that was nice I don't know if you guys can see it hopefully I can show it but that was a quick little preview there the pin particles that were fighting for and they went ahead and switched over and I have that lab I thought was real nice you know because Pim has a lab and there's fire around but this was a quick little one very simple that uh, Vega 185 came up with so I give him a lot of credit for that and then of course we're working with someone back here and stuff like that Alright guys, I appreciate it. I know this video was long and uh, thank you for uh, watching. And again, this was my little haul. Uh, let me know guys if there's anything you guys are looking for. You know, again, I'm trying to lay off from that. But uh, again, shout outs to the people I uh, I mentioned. And uh, you know, like in the interest of peace, just like this guy took the first step, you know. Believe it or not, man, I'll, I'll give Loot Dog a shout out. You know what I'm saying? Um, I had my differences with him, but you know what, man? The new year's coming up and uh, I don't want any more bad blood. So, um, you know, I don't talk to him anymore, but you know what? I wish him the best of luck. Uh, he's a good guy. Again, he, he's got his faults just like I got mine and everybody else does. But, you know, shout outs to, um, hell, even Sentry, man. You know what I'm saying? I know him and I butt heads, but you know what? Uh, he's good people. He's, he's, he's a good guy. He's, uh, he's done a lot for the community, you know. But uh, boxing, KJ, um, Max Solo, I haven't heard from. But all the guys that are uh, stuck by me and, uh, you know, they know the kind of person that I am. 
you know, I, ha I haven't seen a lot of guys out there and I haven't heard from them, Dirkified, and uh, there's some guys that have disappeared, but a lot of shout outs to you guys out there, uh, Original Snake 32, Golden Hammer, Memo Cobra, Mexican Marauder, I haven't heard from you guys, no nays, alright, so this was my little stash and I wanted to give a few little shout outs to, uh, to a few guys I haven't spoken to again, so, um, alright guys, take care.